I got this feeling inside my bones. It goes electric, baby, when I turn it on. All through my city, all through my home. We're flying up, no ceiling when we in our zone. I got that sunshine in my pocket. Got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, RHS. I'm Madison Hamilton. And I'm Luke Ariola. And this is your Daily Dose for Thursday, February 23rd, 2017. Last week's Winter Spirit Week was a huge success. The juniors took the Lip Sync crown and the week's spirit title. Many students participated. Lip Sync will be highlighted throughout this week, so stay tuned. Figure skating states are coming up. Braylon took a closer look on how the skaters are preparing. This past Tuesday, figure skating had their district competition determining whether they make it to states. A team placed third, B team placed fourth, and C team placed second, qualifying C team for states. We took a closer look to see how they prepare. What are you performing at states? Um, I'm doing the two foot spin. Well, I only do four elements on C team, and it's the moves in the field and it's all four preliminary moves. I have a sit spin and a back spin and then a toe loop jump. How did you prepare when you found out you were going to States? Um, well, we just got up every Wednesday morning at like 6 and we had to be at the rink by 6.20. Uh, I practice in the morning with the team and then I also practice individually a few times a week. How often do you practice? Well, I practice with my team on Wednesdays before school from 6.30 to 7.20, but I also skate um, five times a week also, and if I have free time, I just run through the moves. When is States? It's the weekend of the 25th and the 26th of March, and it's at the Rochester Onyx Ice Rink. Good luck at States Bears. No back to the anchors. Thanks, Braylon. All those interested in participating in track and field this spring, there will be an informational meeting next Wednesday, March 1st, immediately after school. Girls will meet in the cafe, and guys will meet in the PE classroom. If you're interested in becoming a member of the 2017-18 yearbook or newspaper staff, pick up an application form from Mrs. Haddad in C119. Applications are due March 3rd. Now let's go to Bailey and Gina to look at some glow-ups here at RHS. Hey, RHS. <laughs> We want to take a look at some of the glow-ups of RHS students. Do you think you had a glow-up? Yes, I do think I had a glow-up. Glow-up? Yeah. Oh, yes, I definitely think I had a glow-up. I can already see a mistake. I'm wearing Aeropostale. That was my go-to pink Aeropostale shirt that I wore all the time. And my hair. I used to put, like, glue in it. It was blue gel. It crusted my hair. It was disgusting. Um, I used to have braces. I don't have braces anymore. I used to wear so much makeup and eyeliner, and I don't even wear makeup at all anymore. Okay, I'm going to show you a picture, and you're going to tell me what you changed and why you did. Um, well, my teeth definitely got straighter since uh, my glow up, and I learned how to brush my hair, and I learned how to dress myself. And why'd you do all that? Because, well, my braces, they're off now because my teeth are straight. And I don't wear makeup because I just think it looks horrible on me and I don't even know what I was thinking. <laughs> why did I change? Well, what would you do if you saw someone walking around high school with fightings and Aeropostale and zebra shorts? Pushing on the stairs, I'd hope. Looks like Ari just had some great glow-ups. We're, We're still waiting for ours. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, ladies. Attention seniors, the graduation list is now posted in the principal's office window. Please check to see if your name is spelled correctly. This list will be used to print diplomas. See Mrs. Arminiak if your name is misspelled. Any changes need to be given to Mrs. Arminiak by February 28th. The St. Patty's Glow Dance is March 18th. Tickets are $10 in advance and $15 at the door. Tickets and guest forms are available in the counselor's office. If you want to help out the shop students with their can construction project, make sure to donate as little as $1 by purchasing a paper can in the post or from Mrs. Rankin. This is not a canned food drive, just donations for purchasing a certain number of cans for their bills. 
Now let's go to Emma for your daily sports report. Hey RHS, it's Emma Slifka here with your daily sports report. Swimming his leagues Friday at Woodhaven, boys varsity basketball won Tuesday 66 to 50 at Southgate. Bowling has regionals this Friday and Saturday at the Woodhaven Lanes. Girls varsity basketball won Tuesday 37 to 23 against Monroe. They played a night at Dearborn at seven. Now back to the anchors. Thanks Emma. Happy birthday to Mary Timms, Kaylee Kellum, Burger, Paige McMahone, Connor Save, and Caitlin Sloat. Hey Madison. Hey what? Who's the king of the classroom? Who? The ruler. <laughs> I've been Madison Hamilton. And I've been Luke Ariola. And remember RHS, you can't hide that bear pride.